Hi, my name is Mark Nichols. I'm an engineer at Air Tractor. In today's video, we're going to demonstrate how to level and weigh an airplane to perform an empty weight and balance. An accurate empty weight and balance is important because it allows you to calculate an accurate loaded weight and balance. An accurate loaded weight and balance is important because it ensures your aircraft will perform and handle as it's intended. When weighing an aircraft, it's important to do it inside a building to ensure that wind doesn't affect the results or cause the airplane to come off the jack. At the Air Tractor factory, airplanes are weighed using floor scales. We realize that most likely you will not have floor scales, so in this video we'll also demonstrate using portable platform scales. Prior to weighing your aircraft, it's important to drain all fuel and remove any equipment that's not part of the empty weight of the airplane. The empty weight of air tractor aircraft is defined by having all drainable fuel drained, the hopper drained, and the rinse tank drained. The smoker oil, windshield washer, and engine oil should all be full. Ensure your scales have a current calibration and you use them in accordance with the manufacturer's recommendations. Position the scales and ramps in front of the main wheels. Carefully tow the aircraft onto the scales. Once the aircraft is on the scales, place chocks. Place the front chalk against the wheel. Leave approximately three inches between the wheel and the back chalk. This will allow the main wheel to roll backwards as the tail is lifted into flight attitude. Position the jack and use blocking as necessary to avoid damaging the tailwheel lock pushrod. Carefully jack the aircraft to level flight attitude. 802, 602, and 502 aircraft are in the level flight attitude at 5 degrees tail down. 401s and 402s are at the level flight attitude at 0 degrees tail down. To verify level flight attitude, use a digital protractor or use a shim and a bubble level as shown. With the aircraft in level flight attitude, it's now time to observe the weight of each wheel. Ensure that any blocking is accounted for by tearing scales. When the aircraft weighing is complete, Carefully lower the tail wheel so the tail wheel is on the ground. Then carefully remove the aircraft from the scale. That concludes our demonstration. For more information, contact your dealer or visit airtractor.com. Thank you for your business and fly safe.